The Democrats who run the Colorado House turned away the families of hostages being held by Hamas today. There are some vocally anti-Israel Democrats in the House, and the Speaker said she was worried that honoring the hostages' families would cause division. They have flown all the way from Israel to talk to us, to ask us to do whatever it is that we can do. And there are things that we can do. We have endured for months now, since October 7th, anti-Semitic remarks and behavior in these chambers, in this building. After the snub from the House, the hostages' families were instead honored in the state Senate, a bipartisan recognition in what was a joint session. Democratic House Speaker Julie McCluskey told us in a statement that she blocked the honor in the House because, quote, I did not have assurances that members on both sides of the aisle would rise to the occasion, and I had concerns that continuing to bring this issue into the chamber would have had long-term detrimental impacts on how we're able to work together for the people of Colorado. The House in particular has seen angry division over the Israel-Hamas conflict lately. Pro-Palestinian protests in the gallery stalled the first day of the session, and leadership reprimanded State Rep. Elizabeth Epps of Denver and removed her from a committee assignment after her confrontation with pro-Israel colleagues during a special session in November. At one point, Epps was shouting from the House gallery alongside pro-Palestinian protesters.